a live look outside at the smoky lakefront. Once again, air quality is a concern because of the smoke drifting down to us from Canada. Albert's here with an update on the smoke and also the storm threat for tomorrow, Albert. Yeah, the air quality is going to improve in a big way later on tonight. That being said, that air quality alert posted until midnight. Tomorrow, that air quality will be in the moderate category, but it's hot. It is humid. We're talking about heat indices on Wednesday afternoon around this time, upper 90s to near 100, and that is a perfect environment for storms, some of which tomorrow could be on the severe side. We'll get a break from the rain chances on Thursday. It's just hot in the 90s on Thursday, and then Friday is going to be an interesting day to watch with another opportunity of severe weather, especially late in the day Friday. So Friday afternoon, Friday evening plans may be in jeopardy if they uh, include the outdoors. Right now we're dry at 89 degrees at O'Hare. It's 88 at the Loop and also in Gary, 86 in Kankakee. DeKalb right now at 85, and we're looking at a quiet radar scan. Just a few high clouds drifting in from the north. Here's what we're tracking though. Next 24 hours, there's a disturbance coming in out of Iowa. That will give us an opportunity for a shower storm overnight into tomorrow morning. And then this system coming out of Minnesota will bring us another opportunity of showers and thunderstorms late morning into the afternoon. So you get the idea, multiple rounds of thunderstorm chances for tomorrow. But we're quiet this evening. By the time we head into midnight, watch this. A couple of showers start to develop out here towards the south and west. And then beyond midnight, a few of those showers and storms drift into Cook County. And at 3 a.m., while many of us are sleeping. A few of these could be on the stronger side, producing some hail and also some gusty winds and lingering at least for the first few hours of the morning rush hour and then a possible second round late morning into the early afternoon. That's a look at lunchtime for tomorrow and some of these could be stronger severe before those storm chances fade away as we get closer to sunset for tomorrow. So our entire area is highlighted under a risk of severe weather, lower risk here that one out of five out here towards the west, but Chicago to Kankakee to Rensselaer a two out of five on the severe weather scale and overall the greatest risk of severe weather tomorrow is going to be in LaPorte County and our main concern tomorrow thunderstorms producing damaging winds and large hail a secondary threat it's not zero but it's there and we'll keep an eye on it a few spin up tornadoes and also some downpours that could trigger some street flooding again those rain chances drop and fade away on Thursday Friday though it could be a busy day we're going to be even hotter on Friday mid to even upper 90s we're not talking heat index we're talking about actual air temperature so anything that develops Friday Friday afternoon, Friday evening will turn severe. Large hail, damaging winds, tornadoes will keep an eye on it on Friday with that high at 95. Behind that system, some cooler air, low 80s as we head towards the weekend. Just a low end chance of rain on Saturday, mid 80s, Monday and Tuesday of next week. So some weather alerts to tell you about. One on Wednesday and a second one on Friday. A lot to contend with. Thank you.